All the second stage tanks now pressurized. 35 seconds and counting. We are still go 30 seconds and counting. Astronauts report it feels good. T minus 25 seconds. 20 seconds and counting. T minus 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. This spring, 18 students from Brooklyn Friends School embarked on an intergalactic voyage. Just as astronauts Neil Armstrong, May C. Jamison, Ron McNair, Sally Ride, and others before them had spent their childhood dreaming of space travel, so too did the children of the Green Room yearn to unlock the mysteries of the universe. Learning facts about clouds, moons, the sun, stars, and planets motivated the students to conduct science experiments, report findings back to NASA, and ensure there would be no mistakes, for there is no margin for error in space. Led by teachers and friends, the children began a rigorous regimen of physical training and intellectual challenges in order to fulfill their wish to become the world's youngest sailors of the sky. The time spent in the gymnasium strengthened their muscles and bones in order to withstand the test of living in zero gravity and prepare their bodies for working in space. Green Room astronauts received tutelage in a mock-up of the space shuttle and launched multiple training missions. During the course of their studies, the children discovered 18 planets that NASA scientists had previously failed to notice. On their first journey into outer space, the Green Room astronauts will be charged with collecting samples, investigating the possibility of alien life, and examining whether humans can survive on other planets. And like NASA's vision statement suggests, our student astronauts and scientists will strive to reach for new heights and reveal the unknown so that what we do and learn will benefit all humankind.